you know, you're, you're getting these kinds of uh, issues uh, that we're seeing on a daily basis. It's pretty scary, but it is scary for them. I mean, they're an older couple, and mm -hmm. you know, they're not 67 and 70. Exactly, and, you know, dad's got a bit of a heart issue, and mom's, you know, a bit anxious right now. But I think, you know, overall, everything is okay for now. It's just we're going to have to take them out of the house, which is unfair yeah. to them. What did they no, they just, they just heard the noise, obviously, you know, the screaming and... and uh, and, you know, the banging and that kind of stuff. Do you know if the fight took place outside or inside? I, to be honest with you, I think it would be inside because I heard the noise from the inside. Yeah, really so they called police around 11? Yes, yes, and, and they called a bylaw, up. and the bylaw officer, you but know. They but called they bylaw? Yeah, uh, the bylaw okay. first. They were told to call the bylaw. How many, how many Again. people did you see there? Um, you know, I was here at about uh, 7 o'clock last night, to be honest with you. I wanted to go down and talk to the kids. There was about uh, 12 kids in that place, and it's only a, like a bachelor apartment, so. Okay, but it's been like that forever. The night before, I had to call the police uh, because they were fighting. It's not the first time, and as soon as they see, they stop. And uh, we can hear them arguing downstairs. One young boy, I think it could be the young boy that got stabbed, I'm not sure. He came walking from pizza and he was really wobbly, he was out of it, went downstairs and it started over again and um, it, it, it's crazy, it's, it's, it's just awful. It's, it's, I, I got nothing against the police because they're there to protect us, but my God, when, when you do complain that much, when you have reports that much in there, there should be a way that when the police come down here, okay, kids go home. Let's go.